everybody, Ace Trend here, and welcome to episode 24 of my Pokemon Sun playthrough. We're gonna face this kid. I'll take him on right now. He's got an Alolan Grimer, and we're gonna see what he can do against us, even though we just beat his dad's muck. Ace Trainer Chase! Hey, it rhymes. I like it. Come on, Grimer, you got nothing on us. Do we think one Fire Fang will do it? Probably. Let's do it. Oh, we're still poisoned. I forgot about that. It don't matter. Ooh, minimize. Oh, typical Grimer tactics. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Oh, you avoided the Fire Fang. Went for the Poison Fang. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm not going to pretend I'm not getting a bit desperate. Should have used acrobatics. Stop avoiding my attacks now. Oh boy. Come on, man. Don't do this to me. Acrobatics. Hit it. Come on. Oh my word. Are you kidding me? I need Aerial Ace right now. Okay, okay, uh, let's go ahead and use Leech Life and hope it hits. Yeah, it did! Just get a little bit of that health back, thank you very much. Only a smidgen, but it was worth it. And down goes Grimer. Easy peasy. So. Blast it all! You, I'm sorry, Father, I'm really just a weakling. You're hired. Father? I'm not your father, I'm your boss. I'm saying that you're hired, boy. From this day forth, I'm making you the head of the plant, and I won't hear another word complained about it. What? You saw that this trainer was stronger than you or even me, and still you and your grandma went up against him with everything you had in you. That's fine. That's what I've always wanted to see from you. That kind of persistence and drive. And that's why you said Grimer. That's why you and Grimer, and that's, that's why you're going to take over from me. Thank you, Father Sir. I mean, former President Sir. I'm sorry for using you to teach my boy a lesson, but when I saw the Island Challenge amulet, it just hit me, you know? Take this for your troubles. A twisted spoon. Wow. Now that I've got my success sorted out, I can finally retire for a life of peace and quiet. I think I trust my boy's crew to keep eating all of Alola's garbage from now on. Yes, sir, you can, sir. What a weird little scenario. I just want to get this. Ooh, an antidote. Lovely. I need that, actually, because, uh, you know, we got uh, a bit of a problem. Go into my bag, get me an antidote. Where are my antidotes? There's my antidote. Thank you very much. And I suppose we'll use a little, a little lemonade to get ourselves back up to speed. Okay, cool. So there's grass around here. We can probably catch something. Uh, answer me the question of the day, which is going to be... What's your favourite new move that you've seen so far? Ignoring Z moves, like, let's not think about those. Let's think about actual new moves that you've seen. So for me, I like, um, I very much like the, I, I can't remember what it's called. Oh, what's it called? The dark type move that hits everything. I'll tell you in a minute. Um, oh no, I haven't got it anymore. Oh, I can't remember what it's called. But there's a dark type move that hits everything. It's something something. <laughs> That's helpful. Sturdy Magnemite. I hate you, man. But you flinched. Don't call for help! No! Stupid Magnemite. Okay. Are they both sturdy? Here we go. That one's sturdy as well. Okay. Oh, this is not going the way I wanted it to go. Okay. Okay, that's not very effective. Idiot. Okay, let's pop into our Pokemon. Bring out Joy. You figured out what I'm doing. Come back, Prodigy. Good job. Oh, Sonic Boom. Okay, definite 20 damage. Oh, no, apparently definite... Yeah, 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 definite 20. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and use Air Cutter on both of you. 
There we go. Job done. I certainly wasn't expecting a Magnemite. I was expecting something better. A Lolan Grimer! That was exactly what I wanted. Can we get it right off the bat with an Ultra Ball? Uh, let's try it. Ultra Ball! Do it. Here. Oh, I was going to say, here we go. Oh, he's minimizing. He's minimizing. Use another Ultra Ball. I just really want to catch. I, I don't want to have to use any moves. Yeah, boy! That's why we do it. Awesome. Got ourselves an Alolan Grimer. Garuru's level 32. Awesome. Grimer's data will be added to the Pokedex. Yay! Awesome. We're doing pretty well on the old Alola Pokedex. Um, a Grimer, which had been brought to solve a problem with garbage, developed over time into this form. Nah, no nickname, and I'll send you to the box. I assume you can find, like, Trubbish and stuff here. Probably. Choose a paralyzed heal, thank you. And then let's head down the hill, but we'll run in the grass to get down the hill. Wait, there's more stuff down here, I think. I can't remember if I've been this way. Oh, it's a trubbish! We can catch a trubbish. Might as well while we're here. Pokemon! No, not Pokemon. Bag. And in the bag, we'll go for a. Actually, a nest ball would work, because you are a lower level than us. Come on. Hey, we caught a Trubbish. Good job. That's what we need. Well, it's not what we need, but we need it for the Pokedex. Hey, you are a Trubbish. Nice. Uh, unsanitary places are what they like best. They can be spotted in Alola, often with Grimer in hot pursuit. Oh yeah, I wonder if Grimer eat them. Go to the PC. Thank you. Oh, I wanted to go that way, because I want to see if there's an item down here. And there is. A Nugget! Oh, I'm glad I came back for that. That's for all the people cursing me, like, why? Why did he go back? Because I wanted a nugget. Let's the back of here. This is obviously the library. Hey, Lily! I did not come from that direction. At all. Liam, I'm sorry, I ended up getting lost yet again. I wandered around completely lost until I ducked into the apparel shop, and then I saw this outfit. And such so as the last one they had in stock, so I bought it. Even I don't think I'd ever have the guts to wear an outfit like it. But the one working at the store did tell me where to find the library, so I guess you could say it was all for the best. I thought the library was actually right past the apparel store, if I just kept going. Whoa, chill out. Oh! She's scared. Tapu. Liam, been quite a while, friend. Looks like your island challenge is coming along favourably. That must be pleasing to the Tapu. So Liam, who might this be? This is my girlfriend, Lily. Oh, hello, my name is Lily. My apologies if Mudsdale spooked you just now. Doesn't seem like you're a trial girl. What are you up to? Oh, I'm actually um, studying the Tapu's ruins for various reasons of my own. Well, that's some fine initiative. I'd be happy to show you the way whenever you'd like to go. My Mudsdale here is as sturdy as old get out. She can easily carry two. Thank you for your offer. Get off me! <laughs> okay, that was that was a fun little situation. Shall we check out Melee Library first, though, since we're here? Uh, yes, but can I can I make my own decisions, please? No? Okay, okay. 
The book that I'm looking for is a very old one. It's a book that contains old myths and legends that Professor Burner told me about. The tale seems to suggest a load of legendary Pokemon came from another world. Oh, you're just gonna go upstairs, are you? Alright. Well, I'm gonna talk to everybody. Feel free, you can read all the books for free. I swear I'd live here if I could. I don't want to die until I've read every last word of every last page of every book in the world. What about people's diaries, their books, and you can't read those? Anyone who's welcome to read the books here at the Marley Library. I came all the way from Johto to visit Alola. Is it true you can't use fly to fly around here? I don't know, is it? Seems like I get told off for trying it. That's it was some kind of law or something. But then how do folks in Alola fly around? On a Charizard? Wow, so everyone just rides around on a special Charizard that had been for, raised for the job? Sounds weird if you ask me. Gotta admit that riding a Charizard would be a blast. Thanks for teaching me about things here in Alola. Here, you might as well have this. Fly is a TM. Why would I need it? Back to where I am in Johto, it's kind of TM is a big deal. They're called hidden machines or HMs because they're hard to get their hands on. But here I guess it's just another TM. Maybe you can use it in battle or something. <laughs> this game's got a bit of a sarcastic tone towards it, towards previous games. I like that. So, fly. Uh, the user soars and then strikes the target on the next turn. So accuracy's been nerfed as well to 95. I don't, I don't really want to teach that to any of my Pokemon. Why would I want a two-turn attack? This is a book of Pokemon! Oh, look, he is here again. Ah, Lola, young Liam. Since you're out and about exploring your island challenge, you must be all ready to know about regional variants, don't you? Yeah, I do. Just as I would have expected. Yes, regional variants. They arise when influences a particular region, cause a Pokemon's physical aspect and even type to change. Even if you caught one of the local Persians. If you've caught one of the local Persians or regional variants, I would like, quite like to see it. Oh. Well, where do I catch them? I heard there's a book somewhere inside, but my legendary Pokemon said to be Alola's very own son. Oh. Let's go upstairs and see if Lily's found a secret place we can have some fun. That's not really effective looking. You need to be close to the books, mate. It must be a very valuable book, so I'm not sure if we'll be able to take it out of the library. Hello. Nice dress. Is this what you're looking for, princess? Give it a read. Oh, of course. What is it? Well, it's titled The Light of Alola. I'll just um, read it aloud, shall I? Oh, go ahead. The empty sky broke asunder. The hole, a hole appearing where, it, where, where had been none. A single beast appeared from it. It was called the beast that devours the sun. The king of Alola bowed before it, the beast that shone so like the sun. The island guardians fought against it, but in the end, the beast had won. Then did the beast that devours the sun shine its light on the line of kings. Then did the beast that had won bring nature's gift to bless all things. Beast of the sun and beast of moon. Through their union, they brought new life, a fragile heir in Alola born. The island guardians would keep from strife. The ancient kings sang their thanks for Sol Galeo with a song of flute. Two tones rang across the altar, a perfect pair ever after mute. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Wondrous stuff. Isn't it great? My dad's books are great. Wait, I mean, yes it is. When you say your father, isn't this book very old? Yeah, it belonged to my dad. I know I don't look it, but my family used to be pretty much royalty. I had to have all my dad's books moved here so it didn't get ruined by the Pokemon. I can tell you lots of old stories about Alola too. You interested? Well, that would be wonderful. I'd be likely if you did. I think I'll stay here. But I know why you've come to Ula Ula. You'll be undergoing another trial, won't you, Liam? Good luck with it. I read that Ula Ula's island's electric type trial can only be reached by bus on Route 10. Wonderful. You keep really selling this bus to me like it's some kind of crazy, uh, crazy gadget. It's fine not to have any great ideology yet. Just don't make any rash decisions. I search truth and ideals and scale extric. Let's go. Where's me Tauros? Here it is. Wait, we haven't been this way. What's this room? Community center. Oh, okay. Let's, let's go in there. Can I ride my Tauros inside? Polywell! I love Alola. Whether the sun shines or rain falls on me, I'll just keep swaying to the rhythm. What are you doing? Just trumping. Are you a trial goer? You should take this item. 
Strange souvenir? What's it for? It's made in an image of the Guardian Tapu who protect our islands. Some people hold onto them as amulets, hoping the image of Tapu will protect them. Who is this kid? I've never met this Electrowind person, but they just beat me in a link battle. Yeah. Oh, you're Incineroar. I guess maybe you'll show it some affection soon, huh? Whoa, what do you mean? Let's go in here. Is this cake decorating? Maybe I'll add a Pokemon to me that can use Sandstream so that my Probo Pass can really fight to the fullest. If you want to know about the weather, you'll be in the right place. This is the weather class. But you're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? Then how about a quiz that takes weather into the arena of Pokemon battles? It'll be a bit longer doing it like this, but I'll give you a reward if you can keep it up. Looks like you have what it takes. Then tell me, my good trainer, which item would you have if a Pokemon... What item would you have a Pokemon hold if you want Rain Dance to last a long time? A Damp Rock. That's it. If Pokemon holding a Damp Rock uses Rain Dance, the Rain Dance will keep for eight turns. Not beaten yet. Next question. Which item would you have a Pokemon hold to make Hail last longer? An Icy Rock. Yup. Okay. Item would you have a Pokemon hold if you want sunshine that goes on for ages? Uh, a heat rock. That's it, correct. If Pokemon holding heat rock uses a sunny day, it would be eight turns. Still need to match. Next question. Which item would you have a Pokemon hold if you want a sandstorm to last a long time? A smooth rock. Yep. Okay. What are you giving me? An icy rock. A smooth rock. A heat rock. Wow, and is she going to give me the damp rock as well? Wow. Okay, thanks for the weather class. There are lots of ways to use the weather to your adventure battles. Give it a try. Like, you could use rain to power up your water type moves and weaken the fire type moves somehow might use against you. Or you could call a sandstorm to deal damage to every turn to a Pokemon that isn't a rock, ground, or steel type. Alright, I get it. I just answered your quiz correctly. You should know that I know all about the weather. We run a little flea market here most days. You should peek inside if you're interested. I love fleas. You know, the piece of this candy I used to love, and I thought it seemed small, so small now. The first time I realised I was growing up. Oh, I was like that with, um, with Skittles. I was fishing on Pony Island the other day, and I managed to read in a bottle cap. Oh, I need those. The two peaks that tower over Ula Ula are Mount Hol Hokulani and Mount Lanakila. Mount Lanakila is so tall that snow falls on it even in the summer. Thank you. If I only had an amulet coin to let my Pokemon carry into battles, I could get double the prize money. Welcome. I'd like to buy from the flea market. What have you got? No tops available. You've just got a hat. Street cap. Oh, it doesn't really look that great. The rare long neck street cap. Right. The rare cruel. The rare thunderbolt. The rare scaly. I don't really want to spend 25 grand on a hat. So much for flea market. Flea markets are meant to be cheap. I found a shiny stone, but what do I do with it? I don't have a Floet or a Zellia anymore that can use it. Oh. Well, this place has been wonderful. Um, I will be sure to not come back. Okay, Tauros, onward. What's down this way? I need to go to the bus stop. Wait a tick. This is Route 11. Who are you? Young boy with an island challenge admin. Your Pokemon are looking a bit tired. Hey! Jolly good. Item in the grass. A big mushroom. Okay, there's trainers there. I've evolved from a swimmer, so I'm a hiker that can swim. Just like me, some Pokemon get another type by evolving. Cool. There's an item in there. Oh, I can't get that way. You see those leaves around there? I heard that Kalos region, there are Pokemon with those leaves in their mouths. Oh, he spotted me. Me and Stuffle aren't messing around. Hmm. I'm not messing around either. I'm just checking how much time I have to defeat you. 
and I'm gonna defeat you. Stuffle! I can beat a Stuffle. I can beat a Stuffle. Don't you worry. I beat Stuffle for days. So we're gonna go ahead and use Acrobatics, because that'll be super effective. Good job, Stuffle. Easy peasy. Good job, mate. Good job. Go and have a cry. Trainer tip. Some Z moves will increase your Pokemon's stats as long as it's enveloped in Z power. Oh, he spotted me! Faith move the mountains. Uh, does it? Okay, man, what you got for me? Black Belt Clayton. Hariyama. See a lot of Hariyama in this uh, generation. Okay, let's use acrobatics on it then. There you go. Acrobatics is very useful. Jobs are good in. Oh, item. A quick ball. We do like quick balls. Who are you? Greetings, trial goer. Let me check your collection of Z crystals. I don't have enough Z crystals. Oh, okay. So you're not going to let me through? Even if I'm really nice? Big mushroom! Okay, what's on this route? What Pokemon are on this route? I have no idea. Trumbeak. Of course it's Trumbeak. Trumbeak everywhere, mate. Run from Trumbeak. I feel like... Maybe we might need to level up before this next trial, because... It seems that... Oh, there's a TM in there. I really need to get in there. Hey, Gyro Ball. Nice. Probably not going to use it, but... Hello, girls. Testing out the results of one's training is the utmost importance. I'm confident in the training I've done with my Pokemon. Check it out. Yeah, I was going to say, um... I feel like we're going to need to level up before the trials, because the Pokemon that are in the wild are level 27, and that seems like quite a jump from the previous, uh... Previous island. Okay. I like the way that they sent their Pokemon out with the tennis rackets there. Okay, Prodigy and Earl can totally do this. Do you know what? I'm not even worried. So, we're going to go ahead and use... we use Darkest Lariat on Herdia. And we will use... Rock Tomb on Fletchender. Darkest Laria, here we go. Didn't quite take him out though. Ooh, Fletchender with the peck. Ooh, crazy. Eat that. It didn't go down? Wow. Ooh, and Herdy with the takedown might take itself out. Ooh, almost. Okay, in that case, we'll do acrobatics on you, and then we'll do another rock tomb. There you go. One down. And then a rock tomb. And you'll go down. And then what we got left. Hey, Earl's level 28. That's good news. Anyone else? Nope. See you later, kids. Any other Pokemon? Let's see. Let's see if there's anything exciting on this route. Ledian, I'm not I'm not classing that as exciting if I'm honest. Prodigy, you are a bit close to leveling up though, so why don't we why don't we use Firefang on this thing? Ooh, that Mac Punch! Super effective, but only did like six damage. And there you go, that was worth it. There we go, level 37. Good job. Let's talk to the healing lady. 
Heal me. There we go. I want to do a trial. Right now. I'm going to have to head on the bus though. That's going to be crazy. I'm going to have to sit with an old person. Oi. Oh, looks like you're a trial girl. I've got a favour to ask you then. Uh, I'd be happy to help. Route 10 is long and wide. Great place to let your Pokemon... My Stuffle haven't been getting much exercise lately, so I let them out of their balls to have them run around a bit. They haven't come back. I want to go look for them, but it's hard for a lady like me to trapeze all around. If you find one, just tell them to come back to me. They're impish creatures, but smart as a cookie with noses that can sniff out anything. They'll find their way back home to me. Will you help me? Sure. Eight Stuffle on Route 10. Okay. What is that? Oh, don't attack me. A pharaoh. Hey, how you doing? If I catch you, I wouldn't need to catch I wouldn't need to take my Spearo out to train. So let's use Leech Life, because it won't be very effective on you. So we can get your health down a little bit. One more. One more leech life. Oh, beautiful. It goes right back up at full health. You're going to use Mirror Move and use Leech Life, which will be neutral on me. That's kind of annoying, though, because it means you're going to get a little bit of health back. Oh, that's put you right back in the yellow. Right then, let's go into our bag and let's use uh, an Ultra Ball. I should use a Quick Ball. Got a Quick Ball and didn't use it. Come on, Fero. Stay in the ball. Hey, good job. Thanks, Fero. Level 35 for Joy. Level 35 for Fury. Awesome. Your data will be added to the Pokedex. And we've completed the Spearow and Fero page. Very nice. So... It's tough and has excellent stamina. It has no problem flying continuously for a whole day, carrying a heavy load. Like a big poop. What are you doing? I was walking by that tree and a Pokemon landed right on my head. I don't know if I should call that luck or what. Call you an idiot. What's that? Oh, a health wing. Thank you. Okay. Oh, what? The first step in the grass. Come on. Oh, and it's blooming Ledian. Let's run away from the Ledian. There we go. I see a stuffle. Oh, not again. Is it another Fero? Yep, it's another Fero. Let's run away. Come on. Run. Oh, we used assurance. We couldn't get away. What? Are you sure? Why can't we get away? We are ten levels higher. We should be able to get away from Fero. Damn it. Okay, let's use Fire Fang. You can outspeed me all you want, but I'm still going to beat you. That's what you get. Lovely. Yay, Chavo leveled up. Wants to learn Dazzling Gleam? No, because it's not a physical move. And you're a physical Pokemon. No point. Okay, we've got some berries. We've got a Hondu Berry. And a Greppa Berry. And a Qualot Berry. Thank you very much. Sniff, sniff. Hey, it's a Stuffle. Stuffle ran off in a hurry. Thank you, Stuffle. There's an item here, too. Paralyzed Heal. Fantastic. Young boy in Island Challenge Amulet. Pokemon are looking a bit tired. Oh, that's good. That's very good. 
Thank you for healing me. I just see a stuffle right here. Yay, that's number two. Went off in a hurry, that's fine. Ooh, a sharp beak. Fantastic. There's a tree right there. Hello, girl. Were you bothered by this beauty strolling along or by my Pokemon? Oh, it's always the beauty, mate. It's always. You know me. Beauty Andrea. Oh, you've got a Steeny. I see. The evolved form of Bound Sweet, right? So we'll go ahead and use, uh, you know, a bit of those acrobatic skills. Easy. Sorry, Steeny. Sorry, Andrea. I didn't mean to. Ooh, oh, don't get too close to that tree. I can see a Stuffle in the grass. Hey, Stuffle. How you doing? Oh, come off it. Not now. I'm on a Stuffle hunt. Oh, I might as well catch a Gumshoe so that I never have to catch a Young... Like, use Young Goose ever. In fact... I don't even want to battle the thing. Quick ball. There we go. Hooray! We caught gumshoes. Don't even have to worry. Nice one, Prodigy. So, gumshoes will be added to the Pokedex. And we've completed that page. Lovely. Come on. The stakeout Pokemon, when it finds a trace of its prey, it patiently stakes out the location, but it's always sneezing, snoozing by nightfall. Sneezing. No nickname. Go to a box and never come out. There's a stuffle right there. Is that, is that three now? I think. I can't remember. There's one here. Spotted that, right? Yeah, dude. Hey, we've got a Zygarde core cube thing in the cube. Oh, there isn't one in here. Uh, not under the gum shoes. I'm not a fan. Not a fan. And there's nothing, it's nothing to do with what it resembles. I just think it's a really ugly Pokemon. There's a Stuffle. Oh, it's so cute. Whoever designed Stuffle, be very proud of yourselves. Get away from the policeman. Don't look at me, pig. There we go. We got another Stuffle. Oh, beans on toast. Come on. Ooh, a wild Skarmory. Skarmory gets sturdy though, doesn't it? Does it? Do we think that's a thing, Liam? I don't know if it does get sturdy. Well, this one do certainly doesn't. Skarmory's abilities. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, Skarmory. It can have sturdy. Keen eye or sturdy. Oh, I can see Team Skull, right? Is there going to be a, a stuffle behind this tree? What are you thugs doing? What? Never seen somebody take a bus stop to go before? Hey, yo, you trying to steal our bus stop? <laughs> Let's go find your own, you heard? You're an idiot. What a pair of dummies. Please be a double battle. For saying Team Skull, they're right, supposed to be really naughty and evil. They, they always fight me like one-on-one, -on -one, and I find that really noble of them. 
Okay, here we go. Let's take out Team Skull's Golbat with a Fire Fang. And it avoided it. Of course it did. Of course it did. Why not? Here we go. Oh, what? As if he lived it. Use a bit of acrobatics beforehand. There we go. Down goes the goal bat. Yay! Good job, Earl. And wants to learn thrash. Nah. Keep old moves. We beat him. Hey, yo, when I fight, I'm not supposed to lose. I absolutely love Team Skull. So much. Dang, I lost. My homie's got to fight you. That's just life in Team Skull. We stand up to even the strong, yo. We stand up enough for long, yo. Oh, we've got to fight him as well. Oh, okay then. Well, that makes all the sense in the world. For a change. Oh, they should have just battled me two on one. And I beat them both. Hey, you got that Alolan Raticate going on. Well, I mean, I need to get some health back, so how about some Leech Life? Awesome! There we go. That was easy. I don't know if you care, but that bus stop weighs about as much as Garlem. Oh, come on. None of that. Yo, think about the bus drivers. If we take this bus stop, they can all chill. They're such idiots. Oh my god. Oh, I'm over this. Back to living large at the mansion. What? Liam! Oh, go away, Kukui. What's going on? Some Team School Punks just ran past me going in the other direction. I'm sure they challenged... Oh, I sure wish they challenged the league instead of getting up to no good all the time. The league? Oh, you'll find out soon enough. Just you wait, cousin. But first things first. If you want to head up Mount Hol uh, Hokulani, you should take the bus. It's a blast up there at the top. It's quick as... Oh, up there to the top. It's quick as a sky uppercut. I don't I don't want to take the bus. No, not yet. I'm looking for I'm looking for Stuffles. Oh, I just got attacked by Fero. Oh, I got attacked by Fero. Why? No, I got attacked by a Skarmory. Okay. Maybe this one will have Sturdy. Maybe. Oh, boy. Let's go. It's sturdy. We can catch it. And it flinched. Okay, let's go in our bag. And let's use a great ball. There you go, Skarmory. Nice one. Hey! Beautiful addition to the Pokedex. There we are, level 38. Wants to learn th Why does everyone want to learn Thrash? Don't bother. Okay, Skarmory's date will be added to the Pokedex. What a beautiful pose. And... The armor bird Pokemon, its feathers which fall off as it grows are thin and sharp. At times long past, warriors use them as swords. Nope, don't need a nickname. You can go to a box. I need to find Stuffles, man. Should I keep looking for Stuffles? No, 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 policeman. I got no beef with you. Where are all the Stuffles? Oh, piss. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, it's another Scar. Why is it all Skarmory now? I got one. Got one, mate. There we go. Is there going to be one behind the tree? Where are all the Stuffles? Use a super repel. 
Yeah, let's just quickly find all these stuffles. Sort by name. Okay. No. You pressed the wrong button. There we go. Where are all the stuffles? They can't honestly be that hard to find. There's one! Sniff sniff! Yay! I think some only appear after you've seen the others. Damn it! Okay, I'm gonna battle this guy and then, then I have to call it an episode because damn this episode's gone on long. Firefighter Alex! Oh, don't make me kill a poly world to end the episode. That's so rude. Look how beautiful it looks. Okay, Prodigy, just make it quick. Acrobatics. There we go. See you later, poly world. Sorry, man. And there we go. We beat Firefighter Alex. Let's get this damn stuffle hunt done. I think I found some. Oh, you child. All my stuff all made it back, thanks to you. Oh, I did get them all. Been a great help to me. Take these, along with my thanks. Never melt ice. Are you serious? 15 grand? Okay, that's better. Cute and strong. That's just a bit wild. Okay. What Pokemon should be like. Very stuffle at its best. Okay, cool. Right, let's head on our little... Uh, a little Tauros. Eh, don't get caught by the police on your Tauros. Right, in tomorrow's episode we're going to get the bus with Professor Q Kui and head up to the mountain for our next trial. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And of course, hit subscribe so you don't miss the next one. Until next time though, I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Keep on training. <laughs>